Hey you, yes you, do you suffer from dry beaver? Are your beaver lips parched? Call the beavers against a lingering dehydration today. With our patented wet beaver technology, we ensure your beaver is moist all day long. Don't believe us? Read our testimonials. Call beavers against lingering dehydration today. A bald beaver is a moist beaver. Hello, sorry about that. Welcome to season four, episode one of Timberborn. We're playing Helix Mountain and our aim is to get a thousand beavers if possible. Uh, but yeah, we'll see how we get on. This is a bigger map. You have your water source here, which goes around in a helix, funnily enough, whilst that's why it's called Helix Mountain. Um, and then it eventually comes down around here. Yes, it does. Comes down around here, goes past our colony, which I've kind of basically set up. A couple of tree choppers, a gatherer's flag uh, farm some housing to be built and this dam which I think isn't going to get built in time um, we have I think our scrap metal we're going to go for is over here and then we need to decide what to do about our water we have one over here so what I'm thinking no I'm not really thinking at all I don't know I haven't worked out what what's the best or optimal way to uh, do it. Ideally, I suppose we'd knock these out and then water can escape there. We'd have some kind of dam going over here or some kind of floodgate so we can stop the bad water when it starts coming from there. And then what we'd do is we'd open this up, have floodgates as well, and when it's good water... We just let it flow down there. I suppose we build a kind of pool around here to uh, suck out or pump out our water from. But yeah, we'll see. Um, it's quite a big map. There's uh, quite a lot you can choose to do. Oh, fucking hell. <laughs> the first drought is on its way already. Yeah, we're going to have dehydrated beavers very soon. All right, let's turn the music back on. There we go. And yeah, let's get things built. Yeah, there's no chance we're going to do this before the first drought. It would be nice, but just simply not going to happen. I suppose what we should probably do is have more water pumps as well. We do have a spare beaver somewhere. Ah, right. Without a platform, we can't build anymore. How have we got 31 when that can store 20? 31 berries, but... Ah, oh, right, okay, there's some in the bush. A berry in the hand is worth two in the bush, is that how the saying goes? Um, I'm not sure how our wood supplies are going to pan out as well, because this is 20 times 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. So we need 200 wood just to make that, and these are two a pop, I think. 2, 4, 6. Uh, so we need a hundred of them, which we probably don't have there. We have other things to build as well. So I think what's going to happen, or what's going to have to happen, is we're going to have to have a checkered pattern again for our tree cutting. So if we do one... No, let's do it there. And then that way we get the baby tree at some point right you're not going to be cut down yeah if we do a checkered pattern then it gives the trees time to grow that's not checkered is it at all it's difficult isn't it doing simple tasks um it gives trees time to grow back essentially which is what we want so it's either side no it's not either side it's above directly above the one that's there okay and uh, directly above. We are, however, going to weave a path up. So pretty much all of this can remain choppable. 
Right. So, yep, you're going to remain shoppable. Directly above one that's green. And yeah, this just allows for replanting of our forest. So we never run out of timber. Except for there, right, and directly above. And again, directly above the green square. There you go, not so hard when you think about it. Yeah, I hope the first drought isn't too long. Um, we're not very prepared. Well, we are quite well prepared. 145 water. This is good. Um... How long is it going to last? Four days. And I imagine the water will kind of disappear almost straight away. Right, let's get some more in the farming. Oh, it's still flowing. Oh, I think we're okay. There's a fair bit of water still flowing. Because it's blocked off there. This pool kind of comes down here. Where it goes down a level as well at this point. Yeah, the water will keep flowing for a day or two. That's not too bad. Uh, right. Where were we? We were planting crops. Let's actually build the road up as well. As much as we can so trees don't grow back there. And we don't need to worry about chopping down trees on the road that's already built. They will not grow there. Oh, there you go. It didn't even last a day. Uh, the water has gone. So we can do some maths here. I'm sure it's not going to be good. We're going to be suffering from dry beaver soon. Um, what have we got? 132 for 12 beavers. Two water a day per beaver. So 24 a day. And we got 120 stored. So... Three days or three by 24 is 60, 72 water. Yeah, we're going to do this easy. I think we may have to keep the beaver population quite low for a while. Uh, you'll definitely need to be chopped. Um, just until we get things sorted out. I imagine the bad water is going to be a complete fucker when it finally comes. Or when it comes. Not finally. I'm not looking forward to it. It's not an exciting point in uh, Timberborn. All oh, right, right, okay, so there's stairs there. Fuck this. Let's go directly from the stairs. There we go. And... There we go. Let's get rid of that superfluous road. So yes, the aim is to try and get either a thousand beavers or a thousand timber bots and survive, really. Just hit that magic number of a thousand and then take it from there. I think it should be doable. I think a timber bot factory can produce 60 timber bots at any given time. So we'd need 10 for 600, just under 20, just under 20 Timberbot factories. And obviously we have to supply that with the necessary timber and, oh dear, this isn't looking too good, is it? Good thing we had our storage there, we have carrots stored. Again, it's two carrots a day, I think, per beaver, so 24 a day. We should be doing this, no problems. Right, let's put the cutting back from where we've not done it. Um, excluding the roads, obviously. Uh, 
Yeah, this whole drought business, though, it doesn't appear to be helping. Um, you can go. Uh, checkerboard. No, not checkerboard. When we need to build a road there. Checkerboard. Yep. And here. And last one. Or is it? There's this one as well, isn't there? There you go, we got water back. Huzzah. We do have three spare beavers. Um, I suppose research. We're going to need research. And I think we're probably going to need to do the old... No, once we got this up and running, our crops should survive. As long as we don't pump out all the water. Fuck, it's going to take a long time to come round, isn't it? It is... That is a long time. So we probably have to add another couple of days. Whereas this one's close to us. And that will go around there. And then I suppose we kind of want to start damming as far down here as possible. Like over here. But that's a big job, so I suppose we need to do a temporary thing. And how many are you? You're one, two, three, maybe four blocks high. And you are one, two, three, four blocks high there. So we kind of want to go across there. And that will be a much bigger pool. In which case we can just have loads of water pumps around there and that will do us for quite a while. I suppose here we could start dynamiting, but... That's a ways away. We need to build up more or have more beavers. Dies in three days. Come on, let's get some water going, please. But maybe I should just destroy this straight away. Demolish. Demolish. There you go, and we get that flowing in that wall. I suppose it will help with farming. We can't get that out until we have stairs and platforms, and we... Oh my fucking word. It's only just started coming back, and there's another drought on the way. Jeez. Hmm. In fact, let's cut trees all along here. I'm going to build my... Shit, we need this done. This is high priority. Why are we dicking around with anything else? Should be this. This is the important one. Um, I think we also need to expand our cutting range. Let's just get these ones done. We we'll take them out in a bit. Right. Oh crap. Crap, 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 crap. I think I've fucked it. We have one spare beaver. We may as well build a beaver cutter over here, make you highest priority too, so you get done. And you can just be high priority. And then you can be lower priority or normal priority. Fuck, that's fine. So what do we need? 6, 46 wood. cutting this one and this one we sort out the checkerboard in a minute just get us 46 wood so we can need 
This is all dead, so we can just cut it away straight away. And it's two a pop. That's good. Um, 1.4 days and we have one more to do. It's going to be close. Yeah, we kind of need this gone so we can start turning planks. Stick a water wheel down there. Because whatever we build next is going to need planks. And I suppose we're going to need gears as well. That will be up there quite soon. Come on, half a day left. You can do it, beavers. Right, we've got 165 water. We don't need that many. Uh, let's make put one more beaver in construction. We're going to do... Yes. Beautiful. So now the water should go up slightly. So it's all kind of zipping over there. And we have access to here with all these oak trees. Beautiful. Um, we do need a researcher. We don't need that many there. You're doing work. It would be nice if we could get rid of these bastards. And then we, oh, then we can finish our road up there. Shit, food's not looking too good either. Four days, we should be okay. That's like a hundred water. Might have to start pulling trees down in a minute. You got broken teeth, you have. What's a teeth grinder cost? Five logs. It's probably worth it. Make you high priority, three, six, nine, twelve, so we can have twelve beavers, which is pretty much what our thing was now, or our population was now. And then I think we'll pause the other ones as they come online. This can probably go in a little bit, once we get our carrots. Good, you're not flowing back. Research is coming along slowly. Good. Technology is going to help us on our quest for the thousand beavers or bots. I still haven't decided yet. Should I have a thousand beavers or a thousand bots? A thousand bots seems easiest. Oh wow, we're just uh, zooming up in happiness. Yeah, a thousand bots seems easiest, but I don't know. I haven't decided yet. Let's quickly drop a save. Uh, this is our save name. Right, let's continue. And we're almost there. Hmm. I think we should probably be chopping wood over here. Let's finish chopping these. In fact, fuck it. Let's just cut everything down here. And we do the checkerboard the other side. Um, we move one of these up slightly. And let's build a road as far as it can go. Okay, that's as far as it can go. That bush was built as I was building my road. Fuck off bush. And... Lumber flag. How are we doing for carrots? We're doing okay. 
kind of need one extra beaver in there though. Let's get rid of this berry place. As long as we don't pump out all this water in the next day, yeah, we should be okay. Uh, right, let's keep the road going. And let's set a cutting schedule. First, I suppose, we need to pull up all these plants. I'm sure they may be of use, but... Mm. Bushes, that is. We just want the bushes, not the trees. There we go. Once that's done, we're set up a... Oh, crumbs. Beavers are dying. Let's pause a couple of houses. So, 12, 15, 18. It's more than enough beavers and probably more than we can supply at the moment. Um, one of you can be moved. Have you got any logs there? You do. So we'll just pause you until all those logs are used. And then we will move the lumber flag over here. In fact, this one can be paused as well. This guy can do both make you higher priority um, how are we doing over here we got two left to cut got 45 lumber stored that's quite good all right we've got a guy in there right okay uh, checkerboard Still, oaks do actually take quite a while to grow. What are you? A birch. Okay, so we've got a mix going on there. Birch aren't exactly brilliant. I mean, pines are two woods, but... Mm. One wood's better than no wood. Why am I pausing this? I don't need to have it paused. Uh, probably need to move our road up a little bit as well otherwise these bushes aren't going to get pulled out yeah wood's going to be our main problem until we set up a forester and farming as well uh, we kind of need to get water dumps and have one of those placed somewhere. We need large water barrels so we can store the water. Bad tides are really going to fuck us at the moment, I think. These trees are dead. Um, yeah, there's going to be longer and longer droughts. So these can just be cut straight off the bat. And... Right. The checkerboard is going. Actually quite calming doing this. It's like colouring in a picture. You have to focus on what you're doing. But you're not really thinking about it either. Uh, right. There you go. I think we kind of need to have it down here a bit as well. And finally... Oh, no. Let's do here too. There we go. Fucking the next drought's on the way already. Wowzers. Wowzers, wowzers, wowzers. Barely filled up from the last time. Alright, you're set to cut. You're set to cut down. Um, we've pulled down all the berry bushes. Good. 
So let's get rid of this road. And I think we build a lumber storage. Which would be not brilliant, but I suppose the good place to have it is about here. Then we can store up some logs and then we'll work on our next construction, whatever that may be. Right, we got the houses. You are superfluous. You need to be paused though because you still have logs. You'll log away once you get some space, maybe. Ah, oh, no available workers and no goods. You got some logs still, you got some logs still. You got some logs still, okay. Take this back down to two. Store logs. I suppose we might as well get rid of this road as well. Give the trees more space to uh, grow. There you go. Beautiful, lots of lovely logs. So next thing was a... Water mill. Where's the water flowing fast? It's flowing fast everywhere. Okay, so you need to be cut quite soon, if possible. Shall we play you and see if we can get you cut? And then... Well, actually, we don't need to cut you, but... Hmm. Power! Water wheel go here that should get built we should have enough and then if we go for wood lumber mill yeah that works and build a road there you go we're getting some lumber now um hmm. the next big thing is what to research platforms are going to be important as our stairs I suppose stairs first maybe and then platforms for a hundred we can build another science guy Back the optimal way to have it. Now we've actually placed some housing. Is facing the housing. Drought has started. Five days. It's getting fucking longer. Uh, the other thing is the big water barrel. If we get that, we'll be doing a lot better. Okay, so that needs gears. So if we also build a second water wheel. That. If we unlock the gear workshop as well. So that's a hundred. Okay, that's going to be our next unlock. Fucking drought. It means it's not flowing very fast anymore. If at all. Yeah, it's probably not going over, so it's not flowing. We have no power. Ech. Maybe this 120 windmill. Yeah, I think the windmill's going to be next on our agenda. The droughts are happening too quickly and the bad tide's going to be coming soon as well. Right, can we get rid of these? We can. Um, we've got a spare guy. We might as well get this tree cut down. Fuck it. Right, and then we can pause you. Or delete you, no good in goods in stock. 
And that's all the trees over here, so this is free to build. Come on, 120 science for a windmill. And hopefully we can stick that behind. Why are you not being built? 50 logs? We have 50 logs. One ten. One one eight. One twenty. Yes, good. Okay, so we can't do it there. Do it there. Hmm. Yeah, I probably messed up there. Um, actually, this road doesn't have to be direct. It can be direct, but it doesn't have to be. It's not as if a road costs anything. So what we can also do is pull down some roadage. There you go, if we have that there with an uh, interconnector. Bang, done. And then when we get to our gear factory, we do something similar over here, and then they'll be joined as well. So combined power. Still fuck. This is a lot of resources. 20 planks. But yeah, if the water's going to be like this all the time, just not flowing, we kind of need it, really. Um, right, you can go now as well, can't you? Yes, you can. So I'm not cutting trees here anymore because there are no trees left. These berry bushes will die out relatively soon and then we won't have to worry about pulling them up to uh, make space. Doing okay for carrots? I may build another warehouse as well, so we have a bit of... S a contingency. There you go, my first time of saying it this playthrough. So we have a contingency. If food starts going down, we actually see it's going down and... Yeah, work out. We need to do something. How much the warehouse house cost? 15 lumber. That's nothing. Let's build two. I say that's nothing, but yeah. How are we doing over here? Right, fuck it. Everything that side gets cut. Uh, Alright, we don't need to cut, cut anything here because there is nothing there. And we need to set these trees up for cutting as well. Maybe I should do the checkerboard here. Yeah, I think I'm going to have to, aren't I? Uh, right, let's start with... Here. Ah, bollocks. Such a simple thing to do. There you go. That will give trees a chance to grow back. At least that's the plan. I think we may have chopped a fair few too many. Kind of got it. Yeah, messed up again. We kind of got our checkerboard in the wrong position because these two are down to be cut. Oh well. Uh, 
we have a few? Hmm. We have a few big trees. Oh, fuck it. Let's just do it. Yeah, I'm going to leave these big trees for the moment. Hope they propagate. Right. Are we at 120? We are. We can build a gear workshop. Beautiful. Where's your entrance? There. Good. Let's tidy these roads up a bit. And I'm not going to build a second windmill just yet, because we're struggling to build the first one. And there's another fucking drought on the way. This has got no power. There we go, now it's talking. The windmill's kind of more important than the plank thing, because once the windmill's built... Then we can have power on a regular basis and actually build more planks to build the gear thing. So we're only getting like two, three days of power at the moment. What I could do is pause you for now. And then come back and unpause you later. And then that way. Yep, that's a sensible option. Then that way it gives a bit of time for these trees to uh, repopulate the area. Um, right, what do we need to do now? We need the levee. We need the floodgate. Floodgate. Because if we put a floodgate up here and destroy this... Then the bad water will stay over there. We can decide what we let in. I suppose here would be optimal for the floodgate. Um, what's that take? 150? Do we have stairs? We do. We could go up here, take these out, put floodgates in. So yeah, floodgates are going to be an important one. Um, and put some floodgates there so we can stop it there and then have it going down here. Which will then go around there. So we'd need platforms as well. If we're going to build our water pumpers. And I suppose we do kind of want to dam off up the end here. Maybe just around there for now. That's a bit much wood though. Until we get this built. Yeah, we're not going to waste wood on that. As I have been using up wood rather quickly, and we don't actually have any more left. Um, if we dam here, that's not going to do any good. Unless we get a water pump. That's the other thing, we need a water pump if this is a long drought, we're in trouble. Ugh, so much to build, not enough resources to do it. Five spare beavers with three more available. I think we need to cut down our beavers. Okay, two homeless. So that means those two will go and we still have spare beavers. Maybe. No, I'm not going to build another one because it uses wood. All our wood needs to be over here at the moment. Um... Yeah, fuck. Okay, I've changed what we need. What we need... It's a forester. And he takes 60, that's nothing. Uh, and then we kind of have the issue... ...of when the bad tide comes, all the trees will die. So we kind of need to do it over here. If 
Fuck, this is a seven day drought. We need to do it away from the streams until we get ourselves sorted. But we can't do that without... Yay, this has been built. We can't do that without planks. Which are on the way. Um... Yeah, we do need to move our wood over. Come on, trees, spread. Um, okay, so we need levees and we need the water pump as well. There's levees, bang, done. And water fluid dump is 250. That's the biggie. Mm, when the bad tide flows, it is going to come down here. So we kind of need to cut here off as well. Um, I suppose we get to more trees if we go this way. Okay. This is a sensible thing to be doing. And then cut trees. We will cut all of these bastards. Yes, please. Thank you, sir. Oh, and you as well. And then we kind of want to work our way up here. Yep, good. We got enough to build these levees. So, 12... 24, 36, plus another 4, 40, maybe, maybe just about. This is going to be taking planks as well, which we need to make. Yeah. Right, you can be paused for a minute. Just until we get this done. Okay, so 8. 20, 32, and we have 25. You got any plans to cut any more soon? No, you haven't, have you? Or have you? If anything, he just got a wanna. Right, we're going to unpause this chat. It's not going to be here for too long. As soon as the bad tides start coming, next to useless. Ugh. And I built the wrong thing. Fuck it, it'll do for now. We actually want dams there. Uh, the reason being, once we release this, the water coming down will get stuck here and then overflow, so we're going to have to replace that at some point. Uh, right. Lumber flag. This will be good though. It will give us uh, loads of lumber. We unpaused you. Yep, we did. We got all the lumber from you. Hooray, we've done it. We're here. And let's start work on our levee system. This is roughly in the middle. So if we do a one, two, three, four. And then we will want this fluid dump, which we still need 250 for. In fact, if we move it down one, it will look more symmetrical. Let's do that then. Right, my unpaused I am. So we're going to need to pull up these bushes.
So if we do it about here, we're going to need some stairs. We need a road. What's it actually take for the fluid dump? Okay, planks and logs. Can we unpause you, Mr. Planky? You should be working straight off the bat. You are. Mm. Still not doing great for timber. Um, you've probably got next to nothing to do. Ah, oh, you can get most of it. Let's build a road down as well so we can get those ones at the end. Every tree counts at the moment. We've got four spare beavers, so why not, eh? Yeah, so the plan is, I suppose, dedicate half to farming and then half to lumberjacking or forestry. So to that effect. We go about there. And then if we do place a forester. Here. Yeah. Or even there. And then, yeah, okay. And we go for oak trees. Not there, we won't. Not in the middle. That's needed for something else. <laughs> needed for the water pump. Right, let's get these stairs done as a priority. Okay, we're making gears now as well. We don't need gears just yet, so let's pause that. We do need planks though. How many planks are we going to need? Ten. Yep, that's ten there, that is. And this will probably get one in the however near future. Mm, you know what? Fuck my stupid checkerboards. You can just go cut everything down. We need the ten planks. Fuck, we need to do... Ugh. Logs. Mm. We're close to what we want. Fluid dump, 250. Oh, it's going to be close. Very close. We're three off getting that, and then we need the 10 logs and 10 planks. And here it should be safe once the bad water comes. But our immediate concern after that is storing enough water. I feel a tick, tick, tick coming with some bad news on the way. Good. So we need seven there, plus for this as well. Not that fluid dump. So 17 planks. Uh, 
There you go. You can get built as well. It doesn't matter which order they're built in, really. As long as they both get built. Um. Yeah, I think this needs to go as well. Or does it? Let's think. Let's think before making rash decisions. If I cut all this down, there's no more fucking lumber coming anywhere. So we need... 16 logs there. Plus 17 there. How many have we got? 8, 16. Oh yeah, plenty. Alright. Fucking get rid of them all. Die, you bastards. Right, we cut all the logs there, and we got some more there we'll be able to get at some point as they grow up. Have we got everything here? Nope, there's just two left to get here. Please be a drought, please be a drought. Is a drought, okay. And then we're going to move this farmhouse, or build a farmhouse over here. Um, so I suppose pulling up all these plants would be a good idea. It's all about the planks. We don't want to over-egg the planks though. I don't think we will. And then next we get the big water barrels, so we can actually survive. But that's a long way off. Right, you got logs, you need three planks. You haven't got everything you need just yet. Two more logs, come on. One plank for this dude. Brilliant, this dude's done. There's not much use at the moment though. Not until this is done. Four planks, brilliant. Right, we don't need two of these here anymore. You can go. Alright, where's the blockage? It's here. What's the best way of getting here? Probably stairs over here. Can we build a road across these? No, we can't. Alright. Um... We're going to have to go up the same height whichever way we go, so it doesn't matter. Let's do it closer to home, though, so the materials get there quicker. If we go up this way, and then we'll work on the stairs a bit later. Shit, was that drought over and the new drought's on the way? It is, isn't it? Right, good, we're green. Um... We need to move our farmhouse over as well, which we can do. So, farmhouse. Could actually have it set on the outside, and then it's not using any water. And then if we plant eight days, fuck, it's getting longer. And then if we just plant carrots all the way up to there, and including here, half of which probably won't get done, we do want to leave space though for a couple of foresters once these oaks get planted. Good. This isn't ideal, we're not doing brilliantly, but we're not dead yet. 
That's the important thing. So to build a water barrel, a large water barrel, 30 planks and 20 cogs, or 20 gears. So we might as well have both of those working. You can go down to one. And we're going to unpause you. And we're going to unpause a house as well. So we are bad tide ready, aside from our water storage. Um, and this for when we go up there. It's not a very fucking large pool. In fact, what we can start doing is build the dam across here. And then we can either delete that. Well, yeah, we can delete it, I suppose. And then the fresh water will just flow up there. And then bad tide will go out there. Yeah, it's not going to be great for pumping purposes, though. It's a very shallow reserve. Something, but not brilliant. Um, be a lot of dynamite in to increase it. Ugh, decisions. Right, there's just one bastard tree left. What are we doing over here? There's a few left. He can get them all, can't he? He can, okay. So he's chopping away. Alright, let's also start work on our... Damn. 20 logs a piece, it's not brilliant, but look at that, it lines up too. I hope there's not some glitch where the bad tide would go through there, but we'll see. A shortage of five beavers. This isn't good. Seven on the way, though. Yeah, seven on the way. Um, I suppose this is excessive. <laughs> can you cover that? You can. All right. Fuck it. You can go. The other farmhouse can deal with it. Oh, shit. We've got no fucking beavers in there. Right, you're a higher priority. You can be a low priority. As can you guys. Uh, we can probably pause you for a little bit just to get one beaver back. There you go, that means we got one building things. You know what? You're not doing anything. You can be paused. And you're not really doing anything either. You can be paused. So now we just have one building that needs a worker. Inventor. Fine. We can deal with that. These trees aren't going to pop up anytime soon. How are we going to do this though? 20... Oh, we've already put four in there. What we could do... Hmm. Pause both of you. We 
we delete a levy? Hmm, how much is a levy? Let's try it like this. Let's try this, see if it will tell us how much. Nine. No, we don't want to. So we need nine. Twenty. Less than nine. Twenty-five. Nine. Eighteen. Yeah, good. Okay. We're going to do it one at a time, working backwards so the beavers can go and recover the actual logs. Where are you guys going? Okay, you're taking it to... Yeah, good. We'll make you high priority. And then they go there, and then we can just... We can't just remove them. We need to put the dams up. We need to put up the floodgates, even. Yeah, just a single floodgate will work. What does that actually need to build, be built? 10 logs and 5, so 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 60, 70. 70 logs and 35 planks, which we're nowhere near doing. Right, that's one salvage. Let's do the next one. Let's make sure these are high priorities. You can be a high priority. No, we don't need to make you high priority. They're going to get you. Or we could just destroy one of them. At a We're going to need to build the stairs up there as well. That on its own is a fucking mission. Right, we have two unemployed beavers. Let's put one in here. Yeah, we survived this drought, no problems. Why are these not built? There you go, one left to go. Do it with one log left to spare, it looks like. Come on. We have carrots coming out of our ass now as well, so we're sorted for food. Um. Anyway, yep, I think it's been about an hour. Thank you very much for watching. It is appreciated. I'll be back again soon with the next episode. Bye-bye.